Hey everyone, it's Dawn with TwiceYearedSheep.com and just like other creatives, I have a tendency to have serial obsessions with different creative arts. So knitting has been a passion of mine for a very long time and knitting led to spinning and to weaving and to all of the wonderful fiber things. But a couple of months ago, I also took up watercolor because I've always wanted to be a fine artist. I mean, you know, I always wanted to draw or to paint or to sculpt or something. Really, I wanted to learn how to paint. So now that I'm in my late 30s and my children have gotten older, I'm like, let's give it a go because, you know, there's no time like the present. And so you can see my, my watercolors that are on the wall. I'm slowly kind of filling up this wall with, with my watercolors and they're getting better and better as I go. Um, last week I painted an alpaca and I loved it so much. I thought it turned out so good. And I knew that my email list, the, I, we call, I call them the knit club, um, for the twice your cheap website. I knew that my friends in the knit club would love this alpaca. And so I scanned this alpaca. This is the alpaca. Isn't she sweet? I love her. <laughs> Or him, I'm not sure. It's got a flower crown, I don't know. So I scanned it and using my um, computer voodoo, I turned it into stickers. Because one of the things that I do at Twice Your Cheap is when I send out stitch markers, um, if you order two or more sets, I send you a stitch marker tin to store your stitch markers in. And so I made little alpaca stitch marker tins specifically for the Knit Club, and I gave them away for free this week. Um, there is a coupon code. I'll put it down in the link below. It's only going to work until the end of the day today. <laughs> so if you're watching this five years from now or two months from now, sorry, you're out of luck. Um, that So I was giving them away for free to my Knit Club because I knew that they would love them. And they did. And I asked them, you know, okay, so this is kind of a whim and watercolor is totally not really the point of Twice Sheared Sheep. The point of Twice Sheared Sheep is fiber and yarn and pretty knitting tools and all that jazz. Um, and even though I love watercolor and it's something that I'm really getting into, it's not what I was planning on offering in, in the shop. So I asked them if they wanted me to keep the alpaca tins in the shop because um, it's something useful, it's something that they might like, and they might like something other than our standard TSS um, stickers on their tins. It's backwards, but... Um, and they told me overwhelmingly, yes, 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 keep the alpaca. We don't want you to get rid of the alpaca. So, you know, twist my arm, the alpaca is staying. So the alpaca is going to be in the shop um, indefinitely until I decide that maybe it's no longer time. So if you again, if you're watching this five years from now and you click on the link and there's no alpaca, sorry. <laughs> um, but I'll go ahead and I'll keep the tins in the shop and just as a bonus, to make it even better, if you've got a lot of tins lying around your house because you bought a lot of stitch markers and you want to change up your purple sticker, I'll go ahead and put up sticker sheets um, so that you can buy some sticker sheets and personalize your own tins or a binder or whatever you want to do. And I'll also put up um, prints of the alpaca. So you can download a print to print and hang on your wall and beautify your space and make you think of lovely fluffy alpacas frolicking, frolicking in the fields. Even if you can't have one in your backyard, you can have one in your studio. So sh click on the link down below um, to find where to get that. It would be twiceyearedsheep.com and um, scroll down to the uh, marker tins category. You may have to click on the shop at the top of the website to get there. And yeah, thank you so much for supporting and enjoying my alpaca. I'm so glad you liked her. And I'm so glad she's going to be sticking around. Um, and with that, I will see you next time. Bye-bye, um, friends.